Okay, this is a quick review of the Walmart gel pen. So at Walmart, they have these gel pen. It just called stick gel pen. They have the eight piece, and I believe they also have the sixteen piece or forty eight pieces um, for a few dollars. So these eight pieces is for a dollar fifty four cents. And I only grab black because I just want a black to go with these. Um, oh, be careful, baby. To go with these um, color gel pen. And guess what? If you had the Costco gel writer, and gel writer only come with like one solid black and one glitter black and all that. If you would, if you would have tossed this. You would know which one is the gel writer. <laughs> it look exactly the same. Unless you you turn over and see the word <laughs> gel writer. Let's see it doesn't focus. And this one just doesn't have anything. However though, the tip of the gel writer is um I believe it's point seven or point one more like point 0.1 and these say point 0.7 right but when it write it feel it does feel kind of like point 0.7 so this should be point 0.1 because it's a thicker tip so the left one so the left one is the gel oh I can't tell anymore oh yeah this one the left is a gel writer and the right is the Walmart brand stick gel pen. And um, if you like something cheaper, you know, um, to me, if you break down a hundred gel pen for twenty bucks or or eight gel pen for dollar sixty, it's about the same price. Um, it's like twenty twenty cents a pen. So, right. Yeah, about 20 cents a pen because this is $1.60. So it's about the same price, but I do like a lot more black. So I, I'm going to use this with this gel pen or with this dollar gel pen. It comes in a pack of six. So six of them for a dollar. So it's about, you know, 17 cents, 15 cents a piece. Just brown up to be 20 cents too. So yeah, that is my, my price for gel pen. Nothing fancy, just something fun. And this one also is the, this one is the same size as a gel writer or Costco gel pen. But the only problem that I have with these gel pen, you see how they have a space between here to here. I like to hold pen closer to the nib. So if you see the, the Pilot G2, how they have the closer nib. You see the profile? I hate this profile pen because it's 1.4, it's so big. But look at the Pentel gel, how they have the grip close to the nib, closer towards the front. I like this type of grip versus these. It just makes my writing a little more sloppy. However, it's still bright, really nice and smooth. So that's just my opinion. If you just want plain, cheap gel pen, you can just get it stick gel pen from Walmart. I mean, I'm not supporting Walmart or any ha anything. I really hate to shop there, but they are the only one who got it for cheap. And then they do have the color version of these, so you can get exactly the same pen. For like for 16 of them, it's about $5, 4.96 or something, and you get 16 or 20 of them in different color. Those are a really good deal too. So if you just like something just to play and color and write notes and stuff, you know, you can't go wrong with this. Costco also have the good deal. It's bigger nib. Some people like that bigger nib to color. It's really good. Then go with the Costco one. It feels a little bit bigger nib. Okay, that's all my review for today. Thank you. Bye.